kind of um, get some exposure to some different things. I um, asked the Army National Guard to come in and do um, a section they do with leadership training with softball teams. No, it is definitely not what I expect out of practice today. <laughs> <laughs> Are you afraid they're going to kill your kids with basic training? <laughs> no, no, they assured me they wouldn't. A, a few things in here are basically pulled directly from the military. First station is just uh, about an 18-inch piece of PVC pipe. It has tape on each end. They are given a ping-pong ball that has to pass through every piece of pipe and be dropped into a milk crate without them touching the ball or the ends of the pipes. Have you ever seen anybody blow on a PVC pipe to get the ball? I have not. That's the first time I've seen it. The uh, next one is a uh, large rectangle and bungee cords are pulled across them and there's holes everywhere. Once they pass through a hole, that hole is closed and they have to get everybody from one side to the next. <laughs> the uh, next one they had to move 10 yards, um, standing on two by fours, walking together, doing left, right, left, right, moving together as a team. And then this last one basically is like a bridge. Uh, they have two pieces of two by eights that are approximately about 10 foot a piece or so and then there's like a 12 12 to a 15 foot gap that they have to get across so they have to come up with good ideas they have to use their heads um, figure out fulcrums leverages so on and so forth and someone has to take charge and and work their way through it it was very interesting and it's a lot more difficult than it looked but it makes you really talk and communicate and things out things through so so hopefully some leadership will come out of this, hopefully just some team building and you start to hear some other voices step forward and um, just having them problem solve together, I think it's a good team exercise.